Hi everyone, Sandy here. Uh, it's been a while since I've repotted anything. Um, since I have some new pots, I decided that what perfect timing, right? Uh, so these are the two new snake plants that I, I have to repot today. Um, so this one, I believe people will call it the Sensevaria uh, cylindrica, or you can call it the starfish plant. Um, there's other names too, but I, I call it the starfish plant. <laughs> the easiest to remember and this one I got at IKEA I'm not sure if you guys watch our uh, IKEA walk around and plant haul um, this one didn't have an ID but when I uh, researched online I believe this is called the Sensevaria fernwood uh, Mikado or just plain fernwood um, if I'm incorrect um, Please comment below and let me know. Um, when I purchased this, there's actually two left. So my sister Erica grabbed one, I grabbed one. So there wasn't much choices. Um, as you can see, is a lot of branches had broken off. Uh, is this just one or two? Hmm. Actually just one. But yeah, there wasn't much to choose from. So I was happy, you know, at least I were able to pick one of these unique ones up. And um, this is actually from, from the pot. The damage is um, caused by the pot because um, when it grows, it scrapes against the edge. So that's another reason why I want to get this out of the pot soon. Uh, let's see, I don't want to break this plant. Ooh. Look at all these roots. Can you guys see it? And uh, should I leave these together or should I separate them? I'm just gonna cut this one right here to separate them. So here, you guys see it? So here's one. You know what? Now that I have this thing out, maybe I should just separate this one too while I'm at it. Ah. Ah. Here's a baby. Okay. I'm not going to reuse. I mean, you see I did break a lot of roots, but you know, no problem. No grow back. Okay. Okay, I'm thinking of putting this in the IKEA pot that I purchased. Uh, this pot was $4 and it comes with a saucer. Very cute. Okay. Okay. I'll plant this later. I don't I don't have a pot that I can think of to use. Okay, so let me clean up a bit and we'll start with the second plant. Okay, I just realized the one I wanted to plant the fern wood, I used it on this guy by mistake. So yeah, I looked around the house and thankfully I have one that looks pretty nice. Right? So I'll put this guy in here. 
Um, this pot was purchased at um, Ocean State Job Lot when they had that um, crazy deal. So yeah, let's get this thing unpotted and pot it up. Um, the reason why I want to get this, uh, get rid of the soil, is because the I think it's like cocoa, cocoa fiber or something. Um, this stuff holds on to the moisture and. Like I mentioned earlier, the Sensevera, they don't like to be wet. So yeah, this is orange. I don't know. Hope it's okay. So let's loosen it up and try and get as much of this stuff off as possible. You know what this thing? I'm just going to pull it off. I'm just going to stick it back into the pot when I'm finished tying this guy up. Well, look at it. You see that? So this was in a small um, plastic um, planter. What should I do? I mean, it's stuck. Yeah, so I uh, messaged my sisters to see if she had the same situation. Um, I don't know, we'll see. But since it's so late, um, I don't want to try messing up with that pot. Um, I mean, we could cut it, but it seems very tight. So I'm just going to pot it up for now and decide later on to see what I can do. Okay, so again, I'm going to use this pot. Okay, let me clean up and I'll show you the finished product. Got. So yeah, earlier I mentioned that there were some that broke off, right? So I'm just gonna stick it in and it'll root for me. No worries. Stick it in. Okay, like that. You know what, I apologize. Um, I shouldn't have recorded this video so late. And when I was repotting this guy up, I realized I didn't even have my light on. Uh, so now with the light, hopefully you guys can see how the final product looks like. So yeah, again, this is the snake plant propagation that I've done. I'll link the video in the description box. Um, everything is rooted very well. You can't pull these out anymore. Um, these are left outside uh, under some, uh, some shade. Uh, north side of my house but it's doing great and this I have um, south side of my house indoors um, but it's a couple of feet away from the the bright light because um, I in the front I do have a porch so that blocks out some of the light so but it's, it seems like it's happy and this one uh, is new um, so I don't know anything about this guy yet but again, um, before you go, make sure you watch till the end. Um, I'll walk around my house and take pictures of my other snake plants that I have in my collection. And again, also before you leave, please give a thumbs up. Um, please subscribe and uh, make sure your, your notification bell is on because we do post videos pretty frequently, at least once a week. So yeah. So um, it's getting late, so good night, and see you guys all soon. Bye-bye.